I know when you come into a jazz club, you're expecting coolness, sophistication. <laughs> it ain't gonna happen here. <laughs> There was no jazz district till 30 years ago. When I was coming up, my father used to drive me around 18th Street, 12th Street, and show me all these places that Charlie Parker used to play, where he used to live, where everybody used to hang out. Back in the 20s and 30s, Kansas City had such a, a thriving live music scene. And so you had all these, these nightclubs here in Kansas City, and the music was phenomenal. Lester Young, Hot Lips Page, Mary Lou Williams, Count Basie, all of these guys playing in all these nightclubs, some of the giants of jazz right here in Kansas City. So when Paul Corey gave me this opportunity, I wanted to do something that dealt with our history. Lonnie's Reno Club is basically, it's a dinner and a show. The show with Lonnie, you know, it's tap dancing, it's singing, it's storytelling. Um, you know, it's a whole experience, you know, from when you walk in the door, from... When you look at the decor, it takes you back not only to that era in the entertainment, the level of service, the quality of food, a place where you, you can experience history and learn about, you know, the history here in Kansas City. When Ronald called me about six months ago saying, what do you think about us doing our full nightclub act at the Reno Club? I was like, whoa. It was more strenuous than what he's doing now. You know, he had to think about it because that's, that's going to make him work harder too. <laughs> it's amazing to me to, to be able to perform with Ronald again. The only person that changes the name of the band just by walking on stage. Because when he gets up here, we become the McFadden brothers. Ladies and gentlemen, my brother Ronald. But to do a full nightclub show, hadn't done it in 13 years until now. And uh, it's challenging, <laughs> but it's fun. That's what we used to do. That's what started us as little kids, dancing on, the, on both sides of my father. So the time was right, and now we do the McFadden Brothers show on the second Sundays of every month. It's still about history class in Kansas City Jazz. And long as I stay in line with that, I'm good. <laughs>